Perfect. I'm good. Sounds good. Perfect. And Ms. Rankin, you can just look right at me um, with the questions. First, I want to start off, um, you know, what is this weight like for you um, as a mother, as a grandmother, feeling this pain? I mean, it's a... It's, it's like it's a he it's heavy it's very heavy um it's like a a wound somebody just keeps pouring alcohol on just like keeps it's a constant sting a constant pain and it just keeps on like it's not getting any better it's like you all are making it worse and worse and worse like they just it, like Yesterday was like killing him all over again. It's like it just put us right back there. Where like from the first day it happened. And this is clearly not justice for you. Um <clears throat> what does this ten year sentence mean for you? What, what it mean it, it means nothing. It means nothing. That was just <laughs> that was nothing. And she, she constantly kept trying to remind us that no matter how much time she gave them, it wouldn't bring my son and my granddaughter back. She just kept, no amount of time is gonna, you don't, you can't speak for us. I think life would have been fine. <laughs> but he, he, he's, he's, he's been in there two years already, so he's gonna do what, six or seven years? And get out and get to be with his family, his kids? I don't get that, we don't get that. That was nothing, that was, she could, they could have just let him go before. At least when Kim Gardner, they talked so bad about her, but at least she was keeping him in there. Whatever way she could, she kept him in there. You, basically, you, she could have let him out. She could, that's how I feel, you could have just let him go. I don't feel she did anything at all. Nothing, nothing. And, and knowing all of this into account, you know, there's several folks with their hands and this um, making decisions about it. Those include Gabe Gore, um, the circuit attorney. Um, earlier today, he said that he understands your grief. Do you? <laughs> I, I, I disagree. You don't care. Like, it's, there's just another case, because I even heard one of them make a comment. We've got 400 cases knocked off, taken off, like getting out the way. Yeah, you just, you just giving out, you just giving out, giving away, you just letting murderers go. That's why people kill every single day, all day. But let somebody get caught with some drugs, they getting 10 and 20 years, but you could kill a seven year old and, and just go. It was a joke, it was a joke. The justice system is a joke, they're a joke, he's a joke, he doesn't care. He doesn't care. He probably don't even know they full name. He don't care, it's just a whole nother caseload to them. And when you think about this, Obviously, there's another suspect. Um, I heard you say you want a civil suit. What's what's next for you when it comes to? Well, next, like I said, it's still another person. So we're gonna deal with that. There's no way. Like I don't want no plea, no nothing. You fooled us. You fooled us once. You won't get the chance to do it again. We're willing to take our chance with that. Cause like at the end of the day, God has the final say. So just it doesn't. This ain't the end. I guess we're not gonna sit here like oh, okay. Like, it don't, it don't end, it's not going to end, that's not justice, and until I get it, I'm going to get it. Whoever I have to turn down, somebody's going to pay. I mean, that's, that's that, that's my word, that is, I will fight for them. That's my job, like I told you, your job is to fight for them, they're not here. That's your job, that's your job. But they didn't care. None of them cared. They all full of it. <laughs> they full of it. And talk to me a little bit, um, you know, about your son and your granddaughter. Um, for people that do, did not know them, um, what were their personalities like? How do you remember them and their best moments? I mean, they're just like, they're both like funny. Like they were like brother and sister, that's how close they were. Like they, they would talk on the phone for hours. Like friends, like who is that in the back? Like that's how they were so close. Like he, he was so funny and giving, he would give whatever, give you whatever. Nobody's perfect, I'm not perfect. You're, nobody is perfect, everybody has done something wrong in their life. But he was a giving person, a heart so big and hers, hers like, 
she wanted to be a baker. She wanted to be a rapper. She that was her dream to be in the studio with him. She was in the studio. She made a little song. She was like, I was in the studio, Grandma. Like that's they were so much alike. Like you really you robbed him of that. You gave him ten years. She didn't get to her tenth birthday. We had to celebrate. We couldn't even celebrate at the cemetery because of the storm, because of all the trees. So we didn't even get to celebrate her tenth birthday. She's not here. You get ten years. You decided that her time was up on this earth, that you know, her, her greatness had to end. And I, and I, won't, I won't sit with it like I told him in the courtroom. You didn't win. You did not win. You did not win. This, this is not it. Uh, he didn't win. And one more question for you. Um, you are unbelievably strong uh, to be dealing with this. It's raw for you. Yeah. Um, you know, and seeing that today, um, how do you get up every day and do this? I just keep praying, like I keep praying. I pray, like I told them, I pray through this whole process and I left it, I leave it in their hands because this is, you all are supposed to help us. We're the victims, family, you're supposed to help us. So what it's like, if I, I have to get up, it's like I, I still, as a mother, my job does not end because he's not here. I still have to fight for them. Like, I will fight to the end. I will not give up. That is my, my motivation to get up and go to school and go to work. And that is why I will not let myself go. I will not give up. That my re they're my reasons. That's my reason right there. That is my reason. Well, thank you for mm -hmm. even talking to us. Um, obviously, your story continues to be